And for everyone with any outdoor plans this weekend or anytime soon, really be prepared for that heat. So let's bring back Robert now. Robert, should any of these concert goers, festival goers, they, they're really in for it. Yeah, I hope they have their light shirts on, you know, because uh, that will help you try to stay cool, drink lots of water, try to limit the alcohol, please, uh, because that will quickly dehydrate you. Uh, there's a look at what we can expect this weekend. And yeah, anywhere you see that red shading, those are the areas that have the best chance at above average or well above average temperatures. And that does include the entire state of uh, Arkansas. Unfortunately, uh, some of these areas, especially the further north you get, uh, 10 to 20 degrees above average. And that sticks around for Sunday as well, as you can see, all because of this heat dome that is getting closer to our area. And as it slowly makes its way closer, that just intensifies the heat uh, because you know, we'll lose our wind speeds and we have more sinking air, sinking air warms and that's uh, that just amplifies all of that heat. This weekend in Northwest Arkansas, it's going to be a hot one, mid to upper 90s with just a little bit of cloud cover on Sunday. That's about it. You see Sunday is a severe day. That's the start of several severe days in a row in Northwest Arkansas and the River Valley. Triple digit heat looks likely in the River Valley both Saturday and Sunday. So please make sure you do whatever you can to protect yourself. Radar is nice and quiet across the area this evening. Maybe one little sprinkle there across uh, east, <laughs> eastern Kansas. That is about it. That's probably not even reaching the ground. We've got temperatures right now in northwest Arkansas lower to mid 90s for the most part. This is without the heat index. These are the actual air temperatures. Uh, triple digit heat, Fort Smith, Greenwood, Pecola, Bacoshi's up to 102. And when you factor in the heat index, it feels about 10 degrees warmer than that. We'll be nice and quiet tonight. Uh, maybe a couple of high clouds filtering around by tomorrow morning as you get up to enjoy your weekend. Already upper 70s for the most part. Our morning low temperatures have been very, very warm, well above where we should be for our morning temps. And then by noon, we're right back into the 90s, quickly warming back up. Some extra cloud cover by Saturday evening, but again, nothing in the way of rainfall or rain, rainfall amounts that are so low it's not a, it's below mentionable levels uh, for the most part and then waking up sunday morning will also be on the warm side some places may not dip below 80 degrees uh, that's why we're so worried about the dangers that come with heat uh, mid 70s for our lows tonight another hot day tomorrow back into the air fryer 90s and triple digits in some locations and you can see all of those severe days because the heat is just so dangerous uh, it, it really is can lull you into a false sense of security, but notice all those upper 90s, well above average temperatures in Northwest Arkansas and in the River Valley. <laughs> There's a lot of numbers there to digest, but they are all hot numbers, Brandon, unfortunately.